Hey, what's up, guys? My name is Q, and I just want to tell you that it does get better. Um, I've known I was gay pretty much my entire life. Um, I think I first realized it when I was about five, but it was, I don't really know the exact age, but it was a very young age that I knew, um, and I was terrified. I grew up in a Christian family, um, pretty strict, um, pretty... Um, you know, for the most part, my hometown, Tulsa, Oklahoma, pretty closed minded. It's the Bible Belt. You know, um, this was a thing that you never talked about. This was something that you kept to yourself and you worked on and you asked God to pray. To, you prayed to you pray to God to pray it away, you know, um, and for the most part, it never went away. <laughs> I'm 20 years old now and I'm just now starting to realize that it's never going away. And this is who I am. And it took me a long time to really realize that. But the older I get, the more, and I'm only 20, so I'm really young. So the older I get, the more I start realizing that, you know, I can't live a lie. Because when you live a lie, it's almost as if you hinder yourself from your life, from the life that you were meant to have, from all the exciting moments in your life that you will have from finding that one person your soulmate you know your whoever finding your boyfriend your girlfriend you hinder that and um it really 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 just i really finally just finally just said you know what i don't care i'm gay you know if you don't accept that then that's not my problem um, and that's how you have to be because it's not your problem because being gay is not a choice um, It is something that you're born with and it should be It should be praised Because it's hard it's Especially in today's society and it's gotten a whole lot better, but um, it's really hard I'm um, coming out and I totally understand you. If you feel like, if you feel weird, if you feel out of place, if you feel like you don't belong, I'm here to tell you that I understand you. I totally understand you. I was there. I was, I had those dark moments. I had those lonely moments. I had those moments when I even decided, even contemplated taking my own life. But for some reason, I've always had this strength that I can't explain. Um, you know, even though my sexuality has pushed me further away from religion. I still do believe in a higher power and I still have faith. I still have strength. And that was able to get me through all the tough times and friends and family, you know, and I'm just, I'm just now starting to come out and, um, you know, I've, I've got nothing but support and love and, um, you know, understanding. But like I said, it starts when you decide to, for it to get better and it will get better but it starts getting better when you let it get better it starts getting better when you finally tell yourself that i'm beautiful i'm perfect just the way i am and nobody can take that away from me and it starts with you being strong as well because if you're not a strong individual if you don't have a strong foundation if you don't have a strong belief system around you and when i say belief system i mean the knowing that you are perfect and you're fine and you're totally you're totally accepted and totally fine and you're totally beautiful just the way you are, then that's when, you know, people would have, can't, can't do anything but move out of the way for you because you finally stood your ground. You finally stuck, took up for yourself and, you know, really just made your presence known and, you know, everybody deserves respect gay, straight, bisexual, transgender. I believe everybody deserves respect. And that's the main thing that I live by, respect. You know, you respect everybody. It doesn't matter who somebody is, you know. Um, everybody deserves respect. And, you know, it really, it does get better. It starts getting better when you, when you decide to let it get better. It starts getting better when you decide to let negativity go. It's, it, it just starts getting better when you decide to finally Accept yourself and love yourself 
wrap your arms around yourself and tell yourself you tell tell yourself how much you love you you know people don't do that you know you can't expect somebody else to love you if you don't love yourself so that's what i want i wanted to tell, say excuse me um and it does get better you know i'm still waiting for it to get better for me it already has me get better but i know there's more exciting moments to come in my life and i'm so excited to stick around and see what happens but it will only happen once you start to accept yourself okay peace and love